Hello again, everybody. Welcome to the Kennedy High School Gymnasium for tonight's NVL Championship Girls game between the Holy Cross Crusaders with a 21-0 record and the Torrington Red Raiders at 17-4. The nice thing about tonight's game is you truly have the two best teams in the league this year. And it needs to be established that this is a championship game, unlike in years past when the NVL tournament was just for the tournament championship. The NVL going to two divisions for the first time this year. This is truly a championship game. Torrington has Michelle Royals, uh, the out, most outstanding senior in the league. She was given that award on Monday night, went over the 1,000 points on Monday night. She had 17 points, so certainly she'll be in Holy Cross's plan to try and stop the Red Raiders. You got the two best teams in the biggest game. What could be better? The two teams met twice during the year, and Torrington clearly gives Holy Cross, which has going, is going for 47 wins in a row tonight, and is ranked number one in the state. Torrington clearly gives them their toughest battle. And Holy Cross obviously will answer with their inside game with Tara Stevenson and the Charlie Glios. And uh, Sarah Hurley, he played a, a really good game for them on Monday night, so he's getting it. Frank, Coach Frank Lombardo is getting it from a lot of different directions. We just had to step on up on defense, play some hard nose defense and force them to take the bad shots, force them to make the turnovers. It's just I mean, when it came down to it, that's what was it. Well, we, we knew we had to play good defense with Torrington because they're, they're always good shooters, good everything, they're hustlers, they fight down to the last minute all the time and we knew we had to take that away. I think just having the whole team together puts a lot of uh, heads and hearts at ease for just the entire team and coaches. And just all of us playing together as a team is really, really great because <laughs> we mesh well together. It's, feels as good as them all because it's a championship title and it means a lot to all of us. It's very satisfying in the fact that some players that work hard every day in practice uh, don't get the notoriety that they deserve and um, you need to be a special player, a special person to play for our system. There's not a lot of publicity, not a lot of big time scores, but they're taught to play as a team and they did that these last two games. And I'm very fortunate to have players that are unselfish and really want to win compared to individual stats.